playing soft coverage, giving up yardage in front of them and not behind. Greer has Jennings touchdown, West Virginia. Yeah, I'm more impressed by that karate kid kick that he just showed. But watch, the physical contact here just doesn't phase him. And in talking to this... The better ones for Texas Tech, we were told he was doubtful and would be a game-time decision. That one is intercepted off the hands of Bowman into the hands of Kenny Robinson. On all of his passes, Bowman makes the first mistake. And Robinson right there to clean it up. This ball is thrown in and behind him. And when you put that, that paw up as a wide receiver, the one thing that you're thinking is, you know, you're still trying to make that play, but you run the risk of tipping the ball right up to the defense. And Bowman off target here is the reason. Onto the ground and into the end zone for six. It's Letty Brown. His and then you saw them really speed it up at the end here and put the pressure on this Texas Tech defense. Back in college football. Yeah, and I think he's my leading Heisman candidate right now for sure. Greer, downfield, looking for Sims. Touchdown, Mountaineers. Defense, passing defense in particular, really struggles. Will Greer here, Balls. that's the young man I've seen on film all week. Bowman, again, plenty of time. Going long, wants Wesley, he's got it. And Texas Tech answers. Agreed. On the delay, McCoy slips past the defense. McCoy, is he in? Touchdown, West Virginia, a 38-yard run. Wow, <laughs> the rhythm of this offense right now. You know, you, you, you pass the ball, you pass the ball, you pass the ball. For sure on that side, and I wouldn't be surprised if Weir goes to his top targets. Greer looking that way. Looking for Jennings, who brings it in. The second touchdown of the game by Gary Jennings. There wasn't anywhere else to throw the ball, but watch this catch at the top of your screen. And they crossed him over. That makes it extremely difficult. No official word on his status, but this is a huge drive because Texas Tech gets the ball first in the second half. Wow. Duffy, downfield, intercepted. Second pick of the half for Kenny Robinson. Robinson into Red Raider territory inside the Texas Tech 40. And now Phil, Texas, this is an ill-advised throw. And you'll see it here at the top of coverage, right? He threw it into the teeth of this defense. Now Duffy under center out of the I formation. Play action. Duffy in trouble. End zone wide open. Touchdown, Texas Tech. Daquan Bowman. Mixed it up. I think it, I think it all started with them getting on the ground, starting to establish themselves. And West Virginia said, we'll do the same thing. Now here's the blitz. Duffy running for his life. Somehow stays in bounds. Jake Duffy. Inside the 10-yard line. How did he do that? The excitement away from this fan base and fans watching at home. Look at Duffy here. Oh my goodness. I mean, I, you just thought, yeah, he was, he was in a phone booth on the sideline and got out of it somehow, but the courage. And once again, the running ability that Roddy and I talked about. This is the difference for him. They brought a six-man pressure, excellent spin, great awareness. Wow. High snap. Pressure up the middle, downfield for Wesley. And Wesley holds it in off the tip. Concentration. Incredible. Higginson and Wesley still hauls in the catch. Going quickly. Duffy, touchdown, Texas Tech. Duffy, watch the suddenness on this cut. I mean, he turns up, Phil. Quick, fast, and in a hurry. Run by DeLeon Ward. Play action. Duffy with time. Intercepted! Keith Washington is going to run it all the way back! Keith Washington. 
One more look. Yeah, this ball's just poorly thrown. Didn't even see Washington in underneath coverage. But you see the deceleration of his arm. That's not that's not the throwing motion that we've seen throughout this game. I, I really think it's surprising that Washington was there. He tried to stop it, but it was too go, it was too far gone. Ended up being just a terrible, terrible throw. This is a big moment for West Virginia. As we told you earlier, Dana Holgerson told us we're going to face adversity in this game. When it was 35 to 10, there was none. Yeah, this was a beautifully thrown ball. Right on target, found the matchup he wanted over the top. Wesley doing the 